How's it going, everyone? I'm Just Wanted Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. <laughs> Alright. I, I, I'm not meaning to do that. Okay. I guess we're turning on automatic retry. You made it! Great! It, yeah! Ow. Ow. I made it, but what, what did I mean it to do? We're getting pretty close to completing the construction of our game of tag. Uh, we're refreshing. I, yeah, I, okay. To make life easier, how about we add an automatic retry? If tagger the runner breaks, a retry will be triggered. Okay. Maybe the object node on. Object break node on. Input. Okay. State change. Hi, honey. Something I can help you with? Um. I don't know why. <laughs> what? What's that you say, hon? That's something you'd like to ask me. Don't be shy. Um. This is weird. That's right. If the tiger or the runner breaks, we'd like you to let us know about it. I'll take care of it, sugar. Don't you worry about the thing. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. Okay. Whoa. I'm assuming person. Yeah. Now close the screen. That's the way to do it, honey. Well, son, now. Okay. Yeah, you guys probably don't want me making games. <laughs> I'm just thinking this now, but if I started making one, it would be brutally hard. Connect the two. If object breaks, you retry. Oh, if only had my time to do over again. Hey, old timer, what's up? It was only yesterday. My backside was itchy, and I thought, I okay, we're done talking. Yeah, awkward is definitely the right word for that. Now the game will restart every time you... Okay. Ow. If one of the characters is destroyed, the game automatically restarts. But don't you think the interval between the character breaking and the retry is a little short? Not really. How about we slow it down a bit? Why? Why would I want to do that? A timer? Not a oh, jeez. Hello, Mr. Clock. Um, I think I get it. Okay, I'm just going to skip the dialogue because I think I understand what it's saying. As long as we're on the same time zone. Uh, moving on. Like the timer note on to the object break one. And the timer to the retry, correct? Yeah, the difference is like a millisecond. If you're done checking that out, let's head back to the program screen, okay? So, step six is complete. That, that, okay. 
step will be the final one, and our game and tag will be complete. Be in the last step, then. Okay. I guess let's go to House's Guide. Restarting the game when an object breaks. Hello, hello! As you can see, there's a person and a box on the game screen at the moment. And I'm breaking the box. He. <laughs> it's like a game builder garage version of Crash Bandicoot. I need to play that at some point. It means that if you break the box, you can retry automatically. Let me explain how this is done. Okay. My, my, if it is a nice day. I, okay. Oh, lighten up. Yeah. I'm not even paying attention. I'm already telling them to be good people. If anyone can do it, I, me. Ugh, you're probably right. I'm sure no state can manage. Oh, filth dicks. I've been rude again, haven't I? If only I could turn back time and take it back. So there's nothing to do about it. I'll just have to use my precious time to teach you. Or we can do it together. Listen up, darling. First, we'll give you an overview of the whole ca Okay. Ye okay. You wait the exact amount of time, and then you send it to this guy. This guy will retry it once this event happens. It's... I know, I get it. It's more each note on does their job in a specific order. One thing triggers another. It's beautiful, if you ask me. You do flatter us, Alice. I think I'm blushing. That's all for now. You need to take it from here and learn what you can. Don't be shy. As I already said, the f I, the fabulous object break note on a jeez. And the first to take the stage. If an object breaks on the game screen, I let others know by sending them a signal. I, I get it. I get it. Okay. Check what? And then we got a large line of different things. screen and this thingy and now it won't restart right yeah see no retry was triggered go back to the program screen okay how was it huh the game didn't reset did it because I'm not set to check for any broken objects don't send a signal any longer not even if a box is broken because I don't send a signal, the retry node on isn't told to trigger a retry. Simple yeah. Tough not being allowed to do anything. Yeah, I feel that one. <laughs> Open the settings. Check. Sphere. Am I blind? I didn't see a sphere over there. Uh, yup, it's me, object node on generating a sphere this time. Okay. So that's what a retry was triggered when the sphere broke. Oh man, I can't. Man, I can't jump! Go ahead and test it out if you want. I mean, I'm doing that right now. I'm not even paying attention to what you're saying. Ugh. Are we done here? Looks like you got the retry working. So happy I've got a broken sphere to keep me company again. <sighs> Is it my turn yet? Gone over on time. No, we still got ten minutes. <laughs> oh, don't get bent out of shape, timer. There's no need to hurry. Easy for you to say, but whatever, I'll, but whatever, I'll breathe. 
I'm a timer and note on. It's my job to wait the seconds, blah, blah, blah. You need to explain it better. There's such a thing as being too brief, you know. Go on, bud, try again. It's a rare opportunity. I wish I could try again more often. Well, honestly, I'll explain again. Just this once. Receive a signal and then send a signal to the other neuron. Yeah, I get it. I know. You can look at the time in my settings if you'd like. As long as you're quick about it. And then this will vary it. Let's set it to 100 seconds. Let's have them wait forever. Output after how many seconds? Um, wait, five? Five whole seconds? That's basically an eternity! <sighs> well, I suppose it's worth testing just this once. Sure. Dum -de dum. Ah, there we go. Do 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 do. Finally. Ah, if you set the timer no on to five seconds, it really does feel like a long time before the retry kicks in. Anyways, I think that's a good example of how the note on works. If you understand just how important I am now. You want something after seven at a time? Ba 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 ba. I'm blessed as usual. No one ever uses old retry note on unless they want to fix a mistake. My job is to reset the game. That's not true. Anybody who creates a game like kind of anything that's similar to that of like troll type stuff, ah, they might want to retry it. They might use this guy. So, I know what you do. Can we just skip all this, please? I get it. Remember how well the three of us work together. Might come in handy in the future. Yeah. Of course, there are all kinds of other things the three of us can do together. Try using this, okay? And don't be afraid to retry if you have to. I always wish I could. Okay. I... It might as well finish, I guess. Hi. But first, let's recap everything we've done. Ow. I don't need to know what we've already done. I'm not stupid. So next, we'll harness your inspiration and creativity to change the color of the level. Okay. Why would I want that's not creative. I guess it can be creative to a fault, but Ta da we changed the color of one of them to black. Run wild with a rainbow of color. I'm going to change the color of every single object note on to whatever you like. Okay. Press done when you. Okay. Ready? Steady. Program! Change the color to. I, I don't know. Lime green! Oops. You know what? Yeah. I really don't care. Done already? I don't really care. Oh, what style? One platform change. Okay. I can declare that development of this game is complete. Wow! <laughs> For 
for a first game, it's great. It's probably one of me one of very few that I actually do. Boing. Okay. What can I say? It's dazzling. I know the text already vanished, but I couldn't help it. That's it. Uh, have I come along? It feels like a long way. Got the makings of a genius programming. Yeah, sure, okay. Back to the menu. Lesson one, game complete. If that date doesn't prove that I don't exactly record these the day before the day of. When a game is finally finished, we say it's good. It's gone gold. It gives you that feeling of accomplishment. That's fair. Ah, so this is the game you made. Now you'll be able to go back and play it anytime you want. Oh, I guess you're probably a little curious about this place. Well, this is the free programming modes, my games list. Put simply, this is where we'll store the games that you build from scratch. Just as the name, free programming suggests. Okay. You've just gotten started with your programming journey. So don't worry if sometimes things don't turn out exactly the way you imagine. As is the life of a programmer. When you've had your fill playing that, let's get back on track with lesson two. Uh, sure. Receive. There you are! Right here is the place where you can receive games that other players have made. Just like this, you'll be able to receive nearby. If you have a Nintendo Switch Online uh, membership, you'll be able to receive games that users have made available online. When you're receiving games from online, you'll need to enter the game ID or programmer ID of the person who shared it. If you receive a game that seems inappropriate in some way, you can report it. Okay. Bye-bye! I don't think I have my... Um, NSO active right now. Couldn't find any nearby games. Well, shoot. And I'm pretty sure this one won't properly connect at all. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh well. I do have the Nintendo Switch Online thing um, on my personal file, so maybe at some point we can use that and go look at other people's projects. But for right now, I'm going to leave this here. Are we going to go through every single lesson? No. Since we finally made this successful, what we'll probably do with next episode is we'll try to look for other levels. Um, or we can make our own. We'll see. Either way around, though, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of what may or may not be the final official episode of this series. Any future episodes would be just kind of extras. Um, I don't know, if you, if you liked watching me do this, uh, make sure to give the video a like, and consider subscribing to the channel. Uh, Want to check out uh, the one other builder type game thing that I've done prior to this, which I may get back into after this. Uh, click on the link in the bottom right corner, you'll be able to check out my playlist for Super Mario Maker 2. Um, if you want to check out any of the stuff done on this ride, click the link across my head here and the train take you there. However, in the meantime, this train's off to its next destination where we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!